YouTube. This is God Squad gameplay, man. I want to show you some new additions to the team, what I've been doing, what I like on offense, defense, special teams, everything that I like, man. If you want to watch me play live, twitch.tv slash dub dot. That link is below. Any offense you see here is madinturf.com. And I also just dropped the defensive ebook. If you guys are struggling on defense, you can check that out at Mad and Turf. If you had the VIP membership, you get all of these things. And you will also get any playbook that I do later future in the year, any additions that I do. I did add one new setup to my offensive playbook. So there's tons of things not only available now, but will continue to be available throughout the year. Madinturf.com. That link is below. Check me on Twitch, man. If you guys are liking the videos, hit the like button. Please subscribe to the YouTube. But this is the God Squad. Let's take a look at what my team looks like right now and the team that I used for this game. Um, and we're rocking Josh Allen at quarterback. Now, Josh Allen just came out. The standouts. This program, the team affinities, whether it's just been a great program all in all, all the way together. So we're going to rock Josh Allen and quarterback this game with that one AP gunslinger. It costs one ability point, so it's super effective, allows you to get a bunch of tons of other things. Um, we have Darren Waller, the limited Raiders tight end. We have Calico. We have Metcalf. We have Amari Cooper, Reggie Bush. I'm going to show you what I also have. We have 50 go deep. We have 55 lockdown. We have 25 49ers and 25 Raiders. Now, I'll tell you guys, as you guys see that right now, look, this is uh, pretty much one of my best mutt things I've, I've ever done to have 55 lockdown, 50 go deep, max go deep, max lockdown, 25 49ers. So all my 49ers get an extra point of speed, whether that be Reggie Bush, um, whether it be Nam De uh, Deion Sanders. Anybody that's on the Niners and the Raiders as well. The Raiders, we got Darren Waller. We have uh, Bo Jackson, Amari Cooper, um, Namdi as well. There's a lot of crossover between the Niners and the Raiders theme teams. So it's pretty easy to get a dual theme team of Niners and Raiders. Mostly it helps Amari Cooper, Darren Waller, Reggie Bush. But then when you go to the defensive side of the ball, now we're going to help DRC, who has Raiders chem. We're going to help Dion, Niners chem. Uh, Ricky Jackson, the new linebacker, has 49ers chem. Khalil Mack, Raiders chem. Doomerville has the, the Niners chem. You know, Alden Smith, Raiders. Richard Seymour, Raiders. Um, we do have this, uh, and we have Namdi. Taylor Mays has uh, 49ers chem. And we have the Derwin James. We have Legereus Sneed. Now, this card, Sneed is a goon. If you guys need a corner that's fast enough to keep up with everybody, Sneed is definitely my third corner that I'm using right now. I use Deion Sanders kind of at the safety position. He's just so versatile and probably the best free safety in the game. Uh, we use Jamal Adams and Derwin at linebacker. Taylor Mays at the other safety spot. So really liking my defense right now with this boosted speed. Once again, we got full Sam Mills too. That's going to help. Um, so I like this team. So let's go ahead and get in this gameplay. This gameplay actually was against Saya. Saya is one of the trickiest players to play. Always running something different. Always running something kind of unique. Uh, and so we'll get into this game. I mean, it was a battle. I feel like this was salary cap. This was all Madden. I feel like the game at all Madden is super defensive. Uh, possessions are at a premium. So we're going to have to play this game like every possession. We need points and play really, really safe. So let's get into it. All right, boys. Now we're going to use this gunslinger. Normally you're used to seeing me with some type of Michael Vick, some type of mobile quarterback. But I'm telling you, this gunslinger flies the ball. It's probably double the speed of normal passes. We see Josh Allen drop back. Uh, just hit this underneath route to Reggie Bush. Gets the ball there before uh, anybody can even get close to Reggie Bush there. As you see, he's running a little 3-3-5. Three, three, There's an out route to Amari Cooper with that Raiders chem getting open. And he puts these guys in contains. As you can see, they kind of push off my tackles. One thing about this game, I'm, I'm telling you, this is the worst the offensive line has been. And we see it again next play. Just gets in a contain, pushes right off of my tackle, and we're out of there. Get to a third and 19. We're going to hit Reggie Bush underneath. Pick up enough to make this fourth and manageable here. Definitely want to go for this fourth down. We, it happens again. That contain. He gets in a contain animation and then doo doop right by my guy. So I get sacked three times on that dry on that series of downs just because of that. So like I said, this is the worst the offensive line has been probably in five, six years, really. And as he hits Darren Waller underneath, um, we've got to make a tackle on that. On defense, I pretty much just run acrobats. This game, I think I'm still on bench press. Uh, now I've gone to seven acrobats in the secondary because I feel like they make the biggest difference. But we get a huge pick 
by that boy, Ladarius Sneed, or Legarius Sneed, uh, and somehow Reggie Bush turns into a bat out of hell and catches me, even though I, I'm pretty sure Sneed is faster than Reggie Bush, but uh, don't, don't get me started on that. We go for the post route. There's Dion, man. All Madden, this man coverage is super tough. If you guys are struggling with all man coverage on All Pro, All Madden is pretty much geeked up. So if you guys are getting ready for Club Series, uh, get a lot of reps against man coverage because it's definitely different on All Pro and All Madden as we see a little bit of under pressure on Dan Marino. He's rocking Dan Marino at quarterback. A lot of people like him with this set feet lead because it's kind of like Gunslinger. And he has hot route master, so he can do a lot of things, save a lot of uh, AP as we see him hitting the flats to Reggie Bush. I feel like I had coverage out there. They just they just did not run out there fast enough. Um, but we stopped the run here. Give him another third and short. Uh, we're going to send some pressure. Nobody gets there. He's able to low ball to uh, Jermichael Finley. He's run a lot of two tight end sets, a little bit of unconventional things. But there's Finley again on Simmons. Simmons is kind of phased out now between Derwin James, Jamal Adams. You want to get somebody in there with a little bit more coverage, a little bit more play recognition and awareness. And uh, Simmons is a little bit stupid. Still a great user, I think, as we see Lawrence Taylor getting in the backfield right there. Uh, as far as man's concerned, there's, there's pass rushers and then there's Lawrence Taylor. He is by far the best. But we do see big Ricky Jackson getting a sack right there, forcing a punt. And we're like, like I said, possessions are a premium. Uh, time flies in these games, and we are already under the two-minute warning in the first uh, half as we step up with Josh Allen here. Go for that post over middle. Boom. DK Metcalf drops it. DRC all over him, but I got I got to have that caught. I got to have that caught. Maybe that new Claypool card will catch that. Hopefully, we get a Randy Moss that can actually beat this man coverage here in the NFL 50 pretty soon. There's Amari Cooper. He can beat the man coverage hitting that corner route. We get a first and 10. We're under 50 seconds left here in the first half. Nowhere to go with the ball. Josh Allen, uh, the reason they like him better than Favre and better than Marino, he has that 84, 85 speed. He can go ahead and get a couple yards scrambling. Here I throw the ball away. Uh, we're at 32 seconds. I have one timeout. Can still pass the ball and bounce. Can still find somebody. We're going to go right here underneath Reggie Bush. Pick up 12 yards. We're going to use our last timeout. 25 seconds. No timeouts. We have to find somebody and get down. Go to the corner route. Amari Cooper. Boom. And we're going to go and spike the ball here. Kick the field goal. Take a 3 nothing lead at halftime. I told you, this is a defensive game uh, on all Madden, I think. You know, offense is good. I, I feel like it's pretty balanced between offense and defense. But when you're playing a good player, especially when you're getting these sheds on this 3-3-5, with the, it's, it's tough to pass the ball, man. It really is. Uh, but we got to make things difficult for Dan Marino on the other side. Throws underneath Reggie Bush. Bush is the best running back in the game. I don't know. I feel like he moves different than Barry Sanders. He moves different as he goes up top and tries Denzel Ward with Reggie Wayne. That's a mismatch in my favor. Denzel Ward comes down with the ball. Now we got to get things started with Josh Allen underneath. Hits my boy um, Odell Beckham in the game right there. O Odell Beckham's a backup, but he's going to make his mark on this game because... I, I think Odell kind of plays a little bit better than his stats and, and might have to give him a starting spot as we have nobody to throw the ball to right here. And we're going to try to run out of there with Josh Allen and we get sacked. That's where escape artists would have got me a first down, would have made some big plays, but we just don't have the mobility. We'll get it with Josh Allen again. Try to scramble with him. We get sacked because this gunslinger is good. But watching this game, I'm telling you, maybe it's time to go back to Michael Vick, man. It's all about trying quarterbacks. See which one fits you the best. Uh, but this gunslinger, I'll tell you, is really good as he gets a couple yards inside zone there with Reggie Bush. Um, we're doing a good job on all the runs. Got to do a better job on Bush on the backfield. I feel like half of his completions are to Reggie Bush. Uh, and I feel like that's everybody in the game now. Everybody, half of their completions are to the running back or the tight end. Uh, so got to try to do a better job of guarding all those guys. Underneath, he tries to throw on 10 people. Knock it away with Calico. We get to a third and 13. Got to get off the field here. Taylor Mays, and we get a big sack from Alden Smith, man. Alden Smith, Raiders chem on the Raiders theme team. If you guys have a Raiders theme team, he is one of the defensive ends for you because he gets about 83 speed at defensive end. I play him at the defensive tackle position. There it is again. Uh, Miles Garrett coming off the edge. Now, this is one thing I always wish they did. I wish uh, we could double team two people. I don't know why we can't double team two people. If we know he's rushing three every play, I can stop one of these guys from contained pushing me, but I can't stop everybody. Once again, Josh Allen, a little bit too slow, and we're going to have to punt again. Three nothing, three minutes left in the fourth quarter. I mean, 
Not exactly a high power football game here, boys. Not exactly high. This is 1940s Lombardi football. Just got to get off. The, just got to make a play on defense. Somebody has to step up. And, you know, I feel like he hasn't crossed the 50. I feel pretty good. Underneath, he hits Reggie Wayne there. I've been running a lot of man coverage. Like I said, this game, I'm still rocking bench press. Uh, I, I think it's been patched. I, or not patched. I think it's been tuned in a huge tackle right there from Jamal Adams. I think it's been tuned so it's not that great as we get a screamer off the edge right there. Lawrence Taylor, third and 17. We're gonna drop back. He's gonna hit Reggie Bush out of the backfield. Get to a fourth and manageable here. I kind of play safe. I don't press. It's only rush three people. Stay back and he goes up top to Caligo. DRC could not make the play. Did not stay in front of him. Got beat on the post route right there. He takes the lead, 56 seconds left. But listen, you guys know I have done more with less. 56 seconds, three timeouts. Josh Allen hasn't looked mobile, but he's been slinging that thing around the field. Uh, the first play, we're going to drop back and once again get that contain off the edge. Um, boom, we got to use a timeout here. Next play, second and 18. We're going to step up with Josh Allen. We're going to see him just hesitate a little bit and hit Odell Beckham for the big time post. Baja, run the sideline, take off as much time as possible, get into the end zone. That was a throw. I saw him just hesitate with his user just a little bit over the top. Odell Beckham, 94 speed, 91 deep route running. If you have max go deep chemistry, which I showed you guys I do, was able to smoke Deion Sanders there. Big touchdown, 30 seconds left. Got to get off the field, and we're bringing some pressure now. We're sending all the dogs. If you guys like any of this pressure, any of this defense, MaddenTurf.com. Second and 16, or second and 10. He hits me with a corner route. Darren Waller has to use a timeout. 21 seconds left in the game. We're going to send the dogs again all over him. Big sack right there. Derwin James coming through the A-gap. Once again, we send everybody and give me the ball. Taylor Mays, end the game. Take it to the Baja. GG's in the chat, man. If you guys like this game, if you like anything about it, man, please hit that like button. We're going to keep pushing out these gameplays. No money spent. I did not play weekend league with it this time. I actually went to my, my girl's parents' house, Cleveland, for the weekend. So I was only able to play one weekend league. But we're back with no money spent this weekend. We're back with God Squad this weekend. 50 games of weekend league this weekend. So make sure twitch.tv slash dub dot. That link is below. Let me know you're from YouTube. I appreciate all you guys checking me out both on this channel and on my other social media channels.